Welcome to ProUpCast News, where we bring you daily industry updates. Today is Wednesday, September 23rd, and you're watching the Afternoon Update with Sarah Fletcher. Today's news is sponsored by... Sunderland Group, your success, our tradition. For more information, please visit www.sunderlandgroup.com. Now for today's headlines. The price per barrel for oil this morning dipped below $70 amid reports of an increase in inventory. In fact, the cost of the commodity for November delivery dropped $2.80 or 3.9% to $68.96 per barrel on the New York Mercantile Exchange. Investors likely await the conclusion of the Fed's two-day meeting at which regulators will determine whether the interest rate should remain unchanged to see whether the price of oil climbs once again. In regulatory news, the Federal Reserve is today expected to hold the federal funds rate, the overnight lending rate in which financial institutions loan money to one another, near zero in an effort to keep steady the slowly rebounding economy. The central bank will likely report on an improving economy, but announced that high unemployment could hinder the financial recovery. Finally, the Fed resumed its two-day policy meeting this morning at 9 a.m. and is expected to issue a statement this afternoon. In property casualty news, the Mortgage Bankers Association's seasonally adjusted index of mortgage applications, which includes both purchase and refinance loans, last week increased 12.8% to 668.5. This rate represents the highest since the week ended May 22nd, when interest rates dipped below 5%. And in terms of refinancing, the rate climbed 17% and applications for purchases climbed 5.6%. I'm Sarah Fletcher and thanks for watching ProUpCast News. For more in-depth news and features, visit ProducersWeb.com.